Hi, I'm Lelania Tussa. I'm the Cultural Support Officer at Anglicares uh, on the Gold Coast. I'm here today to talk to you about um, the Kuba Mary experience and um, the great work that the Year 10 students have done. So it's um, a virtual gaming machine that the Year 10 IT class, which was headed by their teacher, Mr. Stephen Tucker, to put together a experience for children and adults to be able to play a gaming app that covers the stories, language and artefacts of the local Kumba Mary area here on the Gold Coast. So each year students work on developing a project and I wanted to do a real world project where it wasn't just thrown away after assessment, where it could actually be of benefit to the community. And so when we were thinking about what sort of project we'd like to work on, we decided that we'd like to have a look at the local Indigenous people. So we consulted with the Indigenous people, the Kumba Mary people, we did some research and we came up with an app that can teach the stories and the culture of the Combo Mary. To have this made and created for us from students that are doing it respectfully it means a lot to our people and to my family. And I'm sure my ancestors are loving that we're getting some information out there for the community. Because we're still learning a lot about our cultural heritage that we've lost over generations as well. So to bring that back we have to start from scratch with a lot of things. And this is an example of that we were able to share the content we had and then the students were able to build upon that by searching and finding out more, fact checking with us. Um, the students, the level of respect they showed towards this project and just seeing the level of content. I understand that coding is involved, but when they opened up the actual pages of how much coding they'd done, it blew us away. It's really, really fascinating to see that they have so much to share with us as well. The collection that we have in the house at the moment is the Aboriginal people and their story from the 1860s to the 1940s. To have an app with modern technology that's going to reach our young people. Young people perhaps aren't so keen at walking through galleries, but they will love playing with the app. So it's a double whammy. Um, we're so lucky to have it and what talented students that have actually put it together. We really do thank them. I'm very proud of it. It's pretty much our first application. You know, this is something I want to do down the track. It's, it's great to get hands-on experience. It's great that it's actually going to, uh, towards a proper cause. Using our passion to develop an application that's actually going to influence the community to delve into Aboriginal culture more is really great. It'll be like a mobile um, app that will go out to all the schools and then more and more uh, students will be able to access it as well as libraries, the local councils, whoever wants to access this can have that and lease it out for free and then we'll just share it around the Gold Coast community so more and more people have access to it.